she asked me not to, but I'm really sorry, Mrs. Hirschfield, I can't not mention you. We think that Marsha has been to 39 Shakespeare. And I'm so happy you're here. Uh, many of us are going to miss Reverend Hauser's laugh during the Shakespeare Fest. She's always here. Thank God we've got Marsha here in the audience, keeping up our tradition. Um, I'm Elisa Delman. I'm the upper school principal. I'm very happy to be here tonight to introduce the show. I just want to tell you a couple things about the show, which tell you why I love having this as part of our curriculum. The exposure to this genre of literature, when students read a play, it's really hard to appreciate that message, unless you know really what it's like to be in theater. And for many of our students, this is going to be their first and last time ever doing theater. So it's really important for them. For their lives, they'll have a much greater appreciation for what a writer did when he or she wrote a play. For some of our students, they're already experienced actors. But for most of them, this is really their first time on the stage, in the backstage, and the whole thing. Um, I also am a big fan of experiential education. Reading Shakespeare is a lot different than trying to perform Shakespeare. We don't really speak in sonnets. So to read a sonnet and to try to understand what that meant, it's much easier to do that if now you're trying to actually get that message across. So the exper experiential education piece is really nice. Um, I'm really proud of our students. I think they're brave. I think we should really respect the courage that it takes to come up with
hit my name. You watch this reason? I'm a Jew. Did not do eyes, did not do hands, organs, dimensions, senses, affections, actions. Fed with the same food, hurt with the same weapons, subject to the same diseases, healed by the same means, warmed and cooled by the same winter and summer as a Christian is. If you prick us, we not bleed. If you tickle us, we not laugh. And if you poison us, we not die. And if you wrong us, shall we not revenge? If we are like you in the rest, we will resemble you in that. For if a Jew wrong a Christian, what is his humility? Revenge. If a Christian wrong a Jew, what should his sufferers be by Christian example? Why revenge? The villainy you teach me, I will execute, and it shall go hard, but I will better the instruction. I'm going to turn my back to 
I will sell that and buy a little cake on the list. Nay, they did. Ah, you like my car. Do you know the same thing, Eric? Do you like the car, sir? Have you like the car, sir? Do you like the car, sir? Is it all hard time on the eye? No. Do you know the car, sir? I do not like my car, sir. I do not like my car, sir. I'm not thinking that I'm not going to die. I know 
our five pairs of twelve Come, what that for me? Have you got leave to go straight to that? I have. Then how you hands farewell to Chelsea? There's a husband to make you a wife. Honest, there's farewell. <laughs> Thank you. 
I've had a most rare vision. I've had a dream past the wit of a man to say what dream it was. Man has got an ass if you go about to expel this dream. We thought it was. That's no man can tell what. We thought it was. And we thought it had. But man has got packs full of what I can say what we thought it had. I am a man hath not heard. The 
smallest monstrous mouse that creeps on the floor. May now perchance both quake and tremble here. When the lion rough and loud is raised on the roar, know that I, one snug the joiner, am a lion's fellow neurose, no lion's dam. For, or no lion, for if I should as lion come and strife into this place, twere pity on my life. This land gone doth the horn man present. <laughs> Stars. Stars of comedy. Stars of tragedy. Stars of 